And that is how you spend 80 Don't fall. <laughs> don't forget episode. all the things you've been uh, told. Everything you've been we told. Don't blink. Don't run. All right, welcome back to Derail Valley. And last episode, we were experimenting with the multiple unit to pull in a load. Two loads, actually, and make over one or end up with a balance over one hundred thousand one hundred thousand dollars told you that this episode we will be experimenting with the manual service but not for this concept because what i want to do is go and get the the wait where is it where is it where is it In this one not the caboose not the dracine because we already have that uh, not the slug but the be2 it's a small 800 ton loco that will be able it's a small loco that will be able to do 800 tons so I want to go and get it first of all before doing that, I need to be. A, I need to find where is it. Where it is. Uh, I need to find it. And after that, I need to recover it and bring it here. So, give me a second, and I will be right back. All right. So I have paid for fast travel from harbor and town all the way up to food factory and town. Now. This is a strategic. Holy. This is a strategic decision of mine. This is the location where I can find the key for the micro shunter. Uh, in the store, if I can find the store, I think it's there. There's a store. Howdy. Um, cassette, cassette. Shovel and lighter. We're going to need that eventually. I would like to have a lantern and a flashlight. But also that, that, and that. Because we have money to burn here. That's our receipt. Just drop it there. Uh, first of all, I will take the shovel. Shovel will go in the backpack. Lantern, I would like the lantern to be somewhere else. Uh, so I'm going to rearrange this. You go there, you go there. You go there and you go there. Then I'm going to... Uh, old Bob's, I think it's here in the machine factory, near the machine factory. So first I'm going to the go to the machine factory because I also want the remote. And while we are here, it's foggy. Um, not a big fan of foggy. Dang it. Um give me a moment to find the the store. Here it is. Uh, I would like the EOT lantern, of course, and the remote. So that's another 26 grand by uh, drop you there. End of train lantern. You are going to go at the end. The remote will go all the way there. Compass will go there. And I prefer you to be there with there. Uh, you are going to get that as a permanent location. Vehicle catalog and the station map, not so much. I don't really care. Uh, sold out, EOT lantern, price light lantern, got all that. Alright. So from here on out, I'm going to... 
basically fast travel with F <laughs> to go to the to the location of the location of this here. Now this used to be where the Dracene was, the handcart, but we're going to get the electric, the, the BE2 there. So I will see you guys when I get there, because there's going to be a whole lot of this. Alright, um, I think I'm a little bit motion sick, but I think we are here. Um, get the key out. Here we are. Oh, that spawned in. Here we are with the micro shunter. Look how cute she is. <laughs> so cute. Right. Um, would you like to be shown around this vehicle and get it running? We only need a little bit of room ahead and a couple minutes. Sure, why not? All right, uh, electrics on, traction motor on, cab light. Headlights. Main reservoir is on, full. Brake cylinder is filled. The train brake, yep. The brake pipe is good. Speedometer. Sand. The forward position. Oops, that's a bit quick. It's only got the train brake and the independent. Uh huh. Temp meter. Correction mode of temperature. Good. Fuel slip. Uh huh. Battery. Ah, that's the fuel gauge. Oh, you know, I say fuel gauge, but. <laughs> Battery charge. Alright. And the voltage. Uh, charge cable sockets are outside. They should be there exactly. Uh huh. Uh huh. All right. Perfect. 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 So we can now get this going. See how fast she's gonna go. Uh, not really quick. But we do get an open window. Nice. Only one. That's too bad. Well, at least you gotta take and get what take what you get. Oh, we're doing thirty-five. You little rascal. Um, what's the battery doing? Still good. Still good. And I am going to drive this all the way towards 
the harbor in town. Am I? All the way here? No. No, I don't think so. I do not think so. This is not capable of doing that. Well, it is capable of doing that, but I am not patient enough to do that. Um, I'm going to fast travel. Yes. Yes, that was a lot of money. I do realize it's about 10 grand in fast traveling alone. But look at we can, what we can do now. We are here. Uh, we can the hand cart, a micro shunter, and summon it for 2,500. What's. Ah, it's inside the building. Alright. Well, in order to save ourselves a little bit of money. I'm going to, while this contest is still here, of course, I'm going to rip the. What are you complaining? You're dringing something. Let's just do some manual service still. Because, um, it's around six grand, so that I still have to cover for the insurance copay. And I prefer not to. So I'm going to see how far I can get with this. Oh, there's a DH4 here. Nice. Now we turn the independent brake on. This will surely get us over. Over shot on the nine switch go forward what did I hear I heard a mouse I heard a kidders 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 hold on I heard a kidders. Where's the kidders? Yeah, if you press F5, then the whole world pauses around you. And you're able to... Kidders! Oh, look at it. Beautiful. Oh, that's scary. It's a kidders. Yeah, a kidders. And while we are moving into the service bay, I would still prefer you to be ready for me to enter. Are you? Yet? Now you are. Ting, 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 ting. Just a little bit more. And I almost forgot we got the remote now. 
And I did not even pair it up. But... Eh. Repair. 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 You're full. Oil repair. Fill. Sorry. Fill the sand that we used. Fill her up with diesel. And now we see that it's not worth it. Because I got to do that three times. And it's three grand each. And my insurance copay is only six grand. So, in order to save money, <laughs> oh, wait, in order to save money, 5,400. Do you have manual? Give me that. Here. Hmm. Excuse you. I reduce it to five thousand. Ah. Oh, I prefer not to. Which one is done? This one is good. All right. So usually it's insurance covering it. But now it's not. So, forward. Push. Mechanical wheels, body's full, oil, it's a lot, sand, it's a lot. Then we take the diesel and we fill her up. And we deposit the money. Drop the receipt. And then we take you, push you once again. Brakes are loose. And we stop the engine. Then we will put you in there. Fill, 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 pull, fill, oil, fill, sand, fill the diesel. There we are. And that's going to be another three grand. Uh huh. And that is how you spend 80, 80 grand in one episode. Uh, everything we er we earned in the last one, we spent in this one. 
But you know, that's okay, that's fine. That's all fine, you know? It's okay. Such is life. You earn and you spend. That's how you grow your business. Because now we also have everything we need. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, it's so strange. <laughs> you because we are going to need this consist later first of all we are going to here to see the fees that are still open uh, these fees are good that's rental fees basically and there we are no fees here nice work I may now buy licenses because the on only thing is I don't have the money for licenses anymore. Even though the logistical hall, I do have exactly enough money for that. And it should bring me out of here fairly quickly, quick, fast, in a hurry. Um, because do we have logistical halls into steel mill? Empty cars only. We need to start making logistical halls first. Alright. In the next episode on Friday, we will focus on creating logistical halls for us to get the hell out of here because this banking here it's quite steep it's heavy it's tough it's over two percent grade so we need a light load to get over that and we really need a run up to it um we have a fourth loco we can use here for for emergency purposes to add to these um, we can turn them around. I'm going to turn them around eventually before we are going to get out of here so that we will back up onto the track here to um, to attach to our logistical hall or hold on maybe we can bring this to machine factory in town. Is that a machine factory in town job? Excavators, excavators, that's this one. Oh, they came in to here. Uh, it's only a shunting job. All right. That's good though, that's good. You can do that. Let's see, the micro shunter is rated for 800 tons on a flat surface. 100 on a 2% on a grid, but we're on a flat surface here. So that's good. We can use a micro shunter here to earn a money but that will be in the next episode i hope you guys enjoyed uh, my spending spree of 80k <laughs> of uh, all the money we made last episode and i hope you enjoyed your weekend and i hope you will enjoy the rest of your week <laughs> don't forget to like subscribe and follow me on all other socials like twitch and x and instagram and wherever you can find me even on facebook between the grandmas and grandpas that are complaining about the youth rascals you can even find me there and on this light pole don't forget to like and subscribe as well and of course the notification bell it helps out the channel a lot and i hope to see you guys in the next episode on friday peace out